the super secure way to tie your belt. So take your belt, find the middle of it, so that means that both ends are the same length. Put the middle on your middle, wrap around behind and back to the front. Grab both layers, hold them together on one side, wrap the other end over both layers, up underneath so it's got both layers held together. Now take that top end of the belt, wrap it over the low end of the belt and pull through so you've got your loop. Now before you tighten off, take each end of the belt and put it down between the two layers that are around your waist. So pull that end through, pull the other end through and now pull tight. And that is the super secure way to tie your belt. Now let's look at a close up. Find the middle of your belt. Place it on your middle. Wrap around behind and back to the front. Hold two layers of the belt together. Wrap the other end over where you're holding the belt together and up underneath both layers. That same side that you just wrapped around, which is now the high side of the belt, take that over the lower side and pull through. Don't pull tight yet though. Now what we want to do is find the two layers of the belt and put the end down between the two layers. And we're going to do this on both sides. And then we pull tight. Benefits of the super secure way of tying your belt. Well basically because you've put both ends of the belt and instead of leaving them hanging out on front, put them between the two layers of the belt, it's much harder for this knot to come undone. So it's less likely to come undone while you're training. And that can be a really good thing. It means you won't be interrupted by having to stop and retie your belt. Um, it does hang a little bit differently though than when you tie it other ways and uh, some people may not like this. But uh, a good way to tie your belt, particularly if you're going to be doing lots of grappling, lots of throwing, lots of rolling on the ground and you don't want the belt to come undone easily.